What's going on, everybody? This is Bishop Brad coming to y'all on the Pepper Chamber of Love. Coming to y'all on a sauce taster today. A sauce coming out of Michigan, baby. Wolverine land. I got Papa Turts. Papa Turts, so hot it hurts. Slow down, slavor the flavor, baby. Hot sauce. Papa Turts made in Michigan. Let's see what this thing says on the side. Uh, it says, Papa Turts handcrafted small batch hot sauce is a quality gourmet hot sauce that not only packs heat, but is also loaded with flavor. We're going to find out now. Made with habanero peppers and tons of fresh garlic, Papa Turts will add a punch to all your favorite dishes. I I hope so, and it better, baby boy. Add it to ketchup, barbecue sauce, soups, chili, and even Bloody Marys. For the perfect blend of heat and flavor, reach for Papa Turt's hot sauce, baby. You can go to... Where's their label at? Where's the... Do they have their... Here we go, here we go. PapaTurt's.com. PapaTurt's. Dot com. Ingredients of this baby is habanero peppers, vinegar, water, carrots, garlic, dried chili, de arbol peppers, lime juice, salt, and spices, baby. So let's get this rolling. Straight up. Taste test. Hot sauce festival. I'm coming up to their booth right now to try this sauce. And I'm about to give you my first impression of love, action, and fun, baby. Let's go. On marketing. Artwork. Label. I love the colors. They're beautiful. They pop. I dig it. I like the way it's got a freaking turtle boiling up some chili on a pot. Look at that chili pepper on his uh, boiling pot right there. Digging it. I give him a strong, I give him a strong seven and a half out of ten. Seven and a half out of ten. For all y'all who are OCD, I'll give him an eight. It's clean. It's cool. I like the, I like the collars. So let's roll, baby. It pops. It catch my eye. It make me multiply and cry and sigh and fly and die. All right, baby boy. You see them rhyming? I should have been a poet and didn't know it. Let's roll. Aroma. Ooh, garlicky. Smells very good. Bunch of spices. Garlic. It smells tomatoey, but it's weird because it doesn't have... Maybe that's that chili diablo peppers is what I'm really smelling. Wow. Aroma, this thing gets an 8 out of 10. I can taste the sauce and the aroma. It smells like a sauce that would be good on top of tacos, of course. Um, pizza. On top of a steak. Alright, baby, let's roll with that. Let's go. It's flavor. Flavor. Come on, you thickness. You thickness of love. Come on, you thickening Michigan thickness. You come on, you Michigan. Come on! Oh, Lord. Freaking Michigan thickness. All right, let's roll. Let's find out. I'm sick of trying to look pretty for all of you, and I quit. About time. Let's roll. Garlicky, chili arbol peppers. Vinegar hitting the back of the throat. I think I taste lime. Lime juice. Salted good. A lot of lime. Bang, man. You know, the I don't really like sauces where the vinegar's in the forefront, and, and, and it kind of is in this. But at the same time, the spices and the way it's blended, the taste of the chilies, this sauce would be good on everything that I've actually named. It'd probably be, it's very universal. Chilies, absolutely. You can, you can use this for really anything and everything. Uh, flavor on this, I would give this a... Um, I'd give it a 7 out of 10 on flavor. Very good. Very good. Uh, it's a good sauce. Um, on heat, I'd give this thing. It's got a little bit of pop to it, which is good. That's the habaneros because I tasted the habaneros too. Um, heat, I'd give it a, a, a 4 out of 10. A five, 4 or 5 for the average person. It packs a little punch. Um, All around product for Papa Turt's hot sauce. 
So hot it hurts. Very good flavored sauce. Very universal sauce. Uh, I would give this an actual 7 out of 10. Very good. Enjoyable. Much love, baby. This is Bishop Brad coming to you on your taster review. Sauce style. Pepper Chamber. I love style. I'm going to see y'all on the next video. Y'all have a good one. Bye-bye.